Hi right guys, it's Five Valley Drones. Uh, got my DJI Air 2. Um, what I've done is I've uh, yesterday I got the urge to buy some uh, Master Air Screw propellers. I've been after these for quite a while, just out of curiosity to see um, what they sound like, how they work. Do they mess up the stability of the drone? So I thought I'd take the plunge, give it a go. So as you can see, yeah, the two here, the original and the master air screw. Uh, the master air screw ones are slightly longer than the originals, and the quality it seems all right, but were they know they seem about the same same quality same th approximately the same thickness but you really can't tell with a hand flexibility and see that and this one yeah about the same they get a bit more flexible as they get to the end and the same with this one it's stiff very stiff in the middle but then a bit bit flexy there so as you can see they're a little bit longer and um, what we'd do I just got I just put one on there I just put one on the drone so you can see which I what I've noticed okay so as I I just put the front left on there and as you can see it just goes over the top where the original you see the difference I'll just try and get them in line for you it just about goes over the top just just in this area here so we'll see how that goes as you can see it's a little bit longer they clip on all right lock in it locks in fine so we'll see how that's how that goes all right okay this is what I was on about earlier Let's see how close let me just put this down a second for you Now, if you were if you were going up fast, would that hit? If you wanted to go up in sports mode, would that hit? Okay, between the body and the the end up there, the closest point I would say you've got three. Two and a half to three millimeters, and underneath the prop, looking at the back like this, you've probably got four to five millimeters. But on this one, just check that. Yeah, this one seems to be lower. You've only got wow, two millimeters. The narrowest point. Look at that. That is. That is close. That is very close. Very, very close. Okay, a mate of mine just asked me about vibration. He says I need to start it up on a worktop. So here we are, we're on a worktop in my garage. There's no no vibration. At all. Steady as a rock. It moving anywhere. It's 
like that this one here is moving a bit but that's just because of the air underneath it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to shut it down I'm going to put the original ones on this one here is moving very slightly okay. tendency to rotate if you were above it the anti-clockwise looking at it from this way see it so looking from here it's, tur it's turning that way around that way very slightly same as Same thing again, it's very, and I mean millimetres if anything. I, I, I just said I can get a photo of it now. Just hold it here for a second. Very, very slight, as I say, in a, same as we've got in a, in a anti-clockwise rotation. But very, very slight. <laughs> 